As millions of Americans brace for severe weather, many others are already assessing the destruction left behind by the same massive storm system affecting the country from coast to coast. The National Weather Service confirming a tornado touched down near Decatur, Texas, tearing the roof off this home and snapping trees in half. A funnel-shaped cloud spotted in Azle. Oh, my God. And a possible tornado seen through this window in Fort Worth. That is getting big. Heavy wind and rain slamming the Lone Star State. Travelers at Dallas-Fort Worth Airport told to take shelter. Nearly two dozen states in total under storm alerts. Similar scenes in Oklahoma where people are now surveying the damage after a tornado hit the town of Wayne before sunrise. The National Weather Service preliminarily rating this tornado an EF2 with winds more than 110 miles per hour. Some residents cleaning up what's left of their homes, piles of debris scattered across neighborhoods. This as people out west dig out nearly six feet of snow falling in the Sierra Nevadas. Highways and ski resorts in Lake Tahoe shut down during the peak of the storm. Arizona also dealing with snowy weather along with Utah, where more than 20 people were hurt after this bus rolled off a snowy highway. And the East Coast will be seeing some severe weather later this week. Storms expected on Thursday in Florida and the I-95 corridor from Washington, D.C. to Boston will have to deal with some heavy rain and strong winds. Rena Roy, ABC News, New York.